Hello! Now, in this video, we're going to be doing some shed building. Uh, something that I won't put in the shed building is laying the brace because I did do a video on that, but it wasn't, uh, didn't film enough of it. I have laid the shed base. What I'm going to do first is I'm going to lay out all these blocks and make sure I've got a square shed base or square shed ball because I'm going to put the wooden uh, woodwork of the shed on top of these blocks when they're concreted in or cemented in um, to keep the wood off the ground. That way it won't rot. Be a nice solid stable base. The concrete here is between five and six inches thick so that's all solid. I've also fixed a bit of the path that was broken there. So for now, I'm just going to go lay some more blocks. They're all roughly lined up. I need to space them out a little bit better. I'm going to lay all those blocks out correctly. We use the builder's uh, line to make sure I've all got them in a straight line. So I'm going to pick the on a tripod and carry on with that. I already put all the blocks in all the four corners as markers to uh, stake the builder's line to and already checked they were square before I started so they mark out the uh, the ends of where the blocks have been laid to uh, and indeed make sure I've got a start of getting them square. Right, that's all the blocks laid out where they should go roughly speaking so the next thing I'm going to do is just check I've still got a square base at least it's not a square where I'm going to lay the actual shed on. So that's all good. Next thing is to mix up some cement and actually stick these blocks down. That will be jobbing a bit. I'll do that in the morning. Be, I think it's probably take a couple of mornings. Right, now are laying blocks. So we've got them all laid out uh, and I'm basically going to start off in that corner uh, and work out from there to lay the blocks. 
I've got a barrow to mix it in, I've got cement, I've got sand, I've got a collection of levels. Uh, that one came from screw fix, they came from little, and a set of trowels of varying sorts from tool station. Uh, I have a shovel, I have some water, and I've got a kneading pad. Right. I'm going to be using a 4 to 1 mix, that's 4 cement, 1 sand, um, and I'm going to crack on now. Put you on the tripod and let's get on with it. Right, let's just see, see what we've ended up with. That's what we've ended up with. It's not a perfect mix, but it's okay. That should do the job. Let's lay some blocks. So here I'm tapping down the block with a, as it happens, a club hammer and then adding as necessary if I do need to a little bit extra cement, checking its level back to front, checking its level against the adjacent block, in this case the corner block, uh, and checking, so checking it level all the way around and checking it's following the builder's line and then moving on to the next block uh, and tapping again. Now, every, the... These blocks are much heavier than bricks, so you need a much stiffer mixture than you would do with bricks. And then I'm filling in the gaps in the, the vertical gaps, joints. And then moving on to the next one and scooping out from the sides, the edge joints, where the cement squeezes out. You can also see in bits where I'm lifting out that as well using a trowel and in effect pointing the joint. There you go. And just scoop that out and then using that to fill in the edge joints.
Hello, right. So that's all the blocks laid all the way along there. And there. And there and there. So the next stage is to build the frame and sit it on top of the blocks. Um, and there we go. The one thing I would say is is handling the blocks without um, gloves on has worn away let's see if I can show you that large parts of my uh, skin on my fingers and thumbs so it's not such a good idea wear gloves when you're laying blocks thank you for watching please like share and subscribe that really helps and constructive comments welcome